Hey guys, this is Mr. Paul Zamora, and today I'm gonna show you my latest invention. And this is the hot tub in Minecraft Pocket Edition. So as you can see, we have here a bot tub. And this is not just an ordinary bot tub. With this creation, you have the option to take a bath into a hot water. So as you can see right now, the water is not yet hot. So to make it hot, all we have to do is to push the button which is located here and look at that as you can see smokes are coming out of the bathtub making it a hot tub and of course the question is can I take a bath even though the water is smoking and the answer is yes this is totally safe you can take a bath even though the bathtub is so hot now of course if you want to turn it off then just push the button once again and there we go there are no more smokes now here I use button instead of lever it's because buttons are more decent looking than levers now this button is acting like a lever as you can see if we're going to push it the machinery will be turned on and if we're going to push it again as you can see it's now turned off so just like a lever so I'm going to teach you how to make this hot tub right now so the first thing that we should do is to dig the ground and we need to create a 3 by 4 rectangle next we're going to dig another layer which is also 3 by 4 and then this time we're going to put block of quartz and the shape must be another rectangle which is hollow at the middle there you go and then we're going to dig this part until we see the bedrock and then we're going to put two iron trap doors there you go next we're going to remove the grass blocks and then we're going to replace the grass blocks by block of quartz next we're going to dig this part until we see the bedrock And then we will put here another block of cords. And then we're going to fly and we're going to put a dropper. The dropper must be facing up. And then we will go here and then we're going to put another dropper. This time it must be facing this way. Next we need to go down and we're going to put another dropper. And this time it must be facing down. So we need to sneak for us to do it. There you go. And lastly, we need to put a hopper. So we need to sneak and we need to top the dropper on top of the block of quartz. There you go. Next, we're going to dig this part about two blocks deep. And then we're going to put a redstone comparator attached to the lowermost dropper. And then what we're going to do is to top this dropper and we're going to put any item so here I'm going to use bucket and then this time we're going to put a button on top just like that now if we're going to push the button as you can see the resin comparator was turned on how about if I'm going to push the button once again so this circuit is actually called the button as the lever circuit simply because we're using a button and it acts like a lever of course the button is more decent looking than the lever and that's the reason why we use the button instead of the lever and then after that we will go here and we're going to dig two blocks deep and also here and also we're going to remove this part next we will go here below and we're going to attach two redstone repeaters here and then also here now all we have to do is to connect the two redstone repeaters to this redstone comparator so let's just dig two blocks below there you go and then we're going to use redstone dust so we're going to put here two redstone dust and then another one here then we're going to use a redstone repeater and another redstone dust now let's try to push the button 
There you go. As you can see, the redstone comparator was activated and the circuit is on all the way to the trap doors. And as you can see, the trap doors are now open. And then if we're going to turn it off, as you can see, it made the iron trap doors close. Now let's go over the redstone contraption that we made using grass blocks. And also this one. Next, we're going to use quartz slabs for us to cover the four sides of our bathtub. And as you can see, we only need water. But before we put the water, all we have to do is to push the button once again. And as you can see, the iron trap doors are now open. And we're going to put here another block of quartz. And then this time, we're going to use blaze eggs. And then we're going to put here three blazes. So just tap the quartz slab, and as you can see, they are making smokes. Now let's remove this block of quartz, and then let's push the button again to cover the blazes. There you go. Now it's time for us to pour some water. So we're going to put the water here and then also here. Now make sure that the water has the same level. There you go. So the level of water is now straight now if you want to hide those blazes as you can see they are so visible it's because we're just using trap doors so for you to hide them you can use splash potion of invisibility so all you have to do is to throw there you go and as you can see the blazes are not visible right now and basically we're done this is now the hot tub so let's now see if it is working so let's now push the button there you go so as you can see smokes are coming out from our hot tub so of course you can use this for decorative purposes especially if you have a mansion or maybe you just want to relax inside your minecraft house so this is how to make a hot tub hope you like it hey guys this is mr pog zamora Please support my three YouTube channels, namely Mr. Pog Zamora, Unique Potato, and Tricky Pumpkin. Mr. Pog Zamora channel is currently focusing on Minecraft Pocket Edition tutorial videos and tricks. This is the only channel you can see cool, weird, and creative inventions for the Minecraft PE world. Some of them are the clone machine. And let's see what will happen. So let's now push the button. There you go. And then let's go here. And then let's just wait. There you go. So as you can see, we have now the cloned pig. The tank. And today I'm going to show you my latest invention. And this is the tank in Minecraft Pocket Edition. Um, he cannot hit me as of the moment, but look at that. This tank is indeed so destructive. I'm on fire right now. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my god. And the Autobot. And this is the Transformer in Minecraft Pocket Edition. And then we will just say Autobots transform. Boom. <laughs> the robot just transformed into a car. Now let's see how the car looks. Look at that. This is an awesome car. So if you're looking for new and unique creations or you just want to learn some cool redstone ideas, then this channel is definitely for you. In general, this channel contains Minecraft PE, Minecraft PC, and SurvivorCraft videos. Another channel showcasing this three is Unique Potato Channel. This channel is known for its cool SurvivorCraft T-Rex videos. There's a very big creature over there. No, not the bear. Oh, it's coming this way. Something wicked this way comes. So, yeah. Is it a dinosaur? Currently, this channel is starting on Roblox gameplays and game showcase. If you are a fan of Survivor Crap and Roblox, then this channel is made just for you. Para naman sa mga kababayan kong Pinoy Minecraft gamers, narito na ang channel na para sa atin, ang Tricky Pumpkin Channel. Sa ngayon, mga Tagalog Minecraft videos ang mapapanood dito.
hangadang channel na ito ang maging most subscribed Pinoy gaming channel sa mundo. At syempre, ito ay posible lamang kung ibibigay nyo sa akin ang inyong umaatikabong suporta. Kaya ng Pinoy mamayagpag sa mundo ng YouTube basta tayo ay sama-sama at nagtutulungan. Hashtag Pinoy YouTubers Rule. Bye now!